Hi guys and welcome to another video by The Three Musketeers. Today we're making a French recipe. Now this French recipe, I learned it in the southern part of France by a very dear person, her name is Julie, and she taught me this recipe, which actually has three tomatoes, bell pepper, onion, three zucchinis, uh, an eggplant, a large eggplant, um, olive oil, salt, tomato paste, and les serves de Provence. These, these herbs, these herbs are really thyme, oregano, uh, basil, all of these Italian and, and Provence herbs that I, I got these in the southern part of France, but you can use whatever herbs you have in your garden or whatever dried herbs you have in your kitchen. We hope you enjoy this recipe. Okay, the first step, the first step in this video is that we're gonna put salt in these eggplants that we've already cut. And what this does, it's gonna drain off the excess water to blanch the eggplant, okay? This way it won't be bitter, it's gonna lose, it's gonna drain all of this water and it won't hurt our tongue. Next, we're gonna dice all the vegetables into uh, big squares, okay? We're gonna dice all of these into big squares. Okay, after dicing all the vegetables in big squares, as you can see, this is not the recipe from the movie. This is, like I said, a southern France recipe. It's from the southern part of France, specifically from Nîmes, a city in the southern part of France. And we hadn't mentioned garlic. We're gonna use about four cloves of garlic, okay? Okay, guys, our first step is that we put the onion. We start with a preheated pan, we add some olive oil, and we start with the onion. We start frying the onion. We don't put the garlic in yet because this can leave a bitter taste. If it gets burnt, it's gonna leave a bitter taste in our ratatouille. Okay, so we start with the onion. Okay, once we've caramelized the onion, we start adding the garlic. Start adding the garlic and the tomato, okay? The tomato needs to really fully cook so that they incorporate really nicely into our ratatouille and into our sauce. Okay, put the garlic in. There we go, start moving it, William. Okay. Nice. Okay, as you can see, this is a really quick dish. Well, it takes uh, a bit to, to cook and to simmer, but it's really simple. Okay, after adding the garlic, we add the tomato. And we let this cook for about two to three minutes. Okay, once we've incorporated our tomato, we're going to start by putting in our eggplant. Mm -hmm. <laughs> eggplant. Okay. We're going to put in our bell pepper and some of the zucchini. I think we, we diced way too much, so we're going to put uh -huh, the bell pepper. Nice. Okay, the zucchini. And we're going to start seasoning this. Okay, so go ahead, William. Put some salt and the of the Provence. All around. And also the zucchini, Damien. Yes, half of it, I think. Mm -hmm. Okay, a little bit more, a little bit more. And then the other Provence. Okay, this, you have to season with the herbs that you want, like we said in the beginning. Make sure you put enough in your, in your hand, spread it around. Before we add the tomato paste, you have to season the, the, the vegetables before adding the tomato paste. Okay, so there we go, yes, enough. We're gonna move it around and we're gonna let all of these vegetables simmer together for around five minutes before adding the tomato paste. Okay, so once we've simmered the vegetables, uh, we put the tomato paste in and we're also adding more of the Provence. This is your time to rectify for flavor. Salt was perfect, but we needed more of these, um, these Italian and French herbs. So we're gonna, we're gonna leave it here. We're gonna let it boil and simmer. We're gonna cover it and let it simmer for about 20 minutes. It really needs to get all of these herbs, all of the flavor within our sauce, and we need to incorporate everything nicely, okay? As you can see, this looks nothing like the Ratatouille recipe from the 
movie, but it's quite tasty as well. Two, one. Okay, as a bonus tip, you might be asking yourself, how are we going to eat this this tomato paste with, with all the vegetables? Well, we're going to accompany it, accompany this with um, some steak. We're marinating the steak right now. We we actually put um, more of the Provence on the top. We put some salt. We put mustard, and we put some of these. Um, Oh, what's this called? The Worcestershire sauce. Oh, yes, Worcestershire sauce. Okay, <laughs> we're going to put the Worcestershire sauce on top uh, to marinate these, these steaks, okay? And we're going to serve it. We're going to have our ratatouille, some pasta on the side, and these steaks that have been marinated by William, our expert marinator, okay? Thank you. We hope you enjoy. Okay, it's been simmering for about 20 minutes at very low heat, and we can see it looks beautiful. It's really tasty. Usually the French eat this as a main dish. They don't accompany it with anything else. But I've got two monsters here who wanted some steak and some pasta, so we're going to eat all these three things. But this is, this is what your ratatouille should look like. Nothing like the movie. Usually has a red bell pepper, but... Since so the quarantine, we didn't have any, so we decided to use yellow, and I think it actually looks better like this. We hope you enjoyed this recipe. Say bye, guys. Bye. Okay, they're off playing Fortnite. <laughs> okay, and this is what our, our recipe looks like. Check this out. We put some cheese. We got our steak and our pasta. Say bye, guys. Bye. Bye. <laughs> we hope you enjoyed this recipe. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Share with others that might like this recipe. Goodbye. Three Musketeers cooking. Ahora le voy a hacer así, va. Orégano. No, mi amor. Orégano. Fine.